Excellency William Ruto and thank him because of giving digital and ICT the attention that it deserves. This is a big industry, a billion dollar industry where if it is supported, it will create a lot of jobs for our youth. And Mr. Speaker, this budget policy statement demonstrates the willingness of the Kenya Kwanzaa government in steering our economy from the mess that was created by the previous regime. Mr. Speaker, I also wish to commend the KRA for the strategies that they have put in place to deal and to harness the collection of revenue. And they're also leveraging on technology as they have joined with um, the telecommunication companies as stated in that uh, statement. They have also they have also sought to digitalize the rent and the property and the and the rental income as well as digitalizing the customs and uh, the border operations mr speaker i am of the view that if if this policy statement is supported, the country will benefit and we are going to harness development. I also urge leaders, and especially leaders in the Azimio side, to engage in politics of development as outlined in this budget policy statement, as opposed to what they are on about right now, demonstrations and hula, politics of hula baloo that do not help Kenyans. And with that, Mr. Speaker, I support.